It's a desperate rescue unfolding along a rain swollen river. Hey, keep going, keep going. A woman is being carried away by a rushing current. Police race along a path above her, trying to keep a pace and reach her with a rope. Go, 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 go. Cops work in tandem on both sides of the river, shouting instructions. Rub it, rub it. They toss the rope, but she floats right by. Here comes a second attempt. Got it? Yes, got it. But then, disaster. She's unable to hold on. Subject has lost the rope, is now floating toward North Hollywood. Stand by. Another team of rescuers arrive on the scene. They drop a life jacket. Now she clings to a wall with all of her might. Sparks fly as LA firefighters cut through a fence to lower a ladder to the woman in peril. She screams as she scrambles to take hold of it. But the force of the rushing water is too strong. She disappears under the overpass. Now, a rescuer from a chopper is lowered into the river as she reappears and finally takes hold of the woman. Up they go to safety. What led to this life and death struggle? The woman reportedly waded into the knee deep river to retrieve her friend's cell phone, which had fallen into the water. But a sudden rainstorm turned the river into a potential death trap. Within a matter of minutes, we went from two to three inches of water to three feet of water. So what looks benign could end up turning disastrous and or deadly within minutes. That very lucky woman was treated for minor injuries and hypothermia.